On this episode of My Nature, we look at the raccoon. The raccoon is a mischievous nocturnal creature, well known for its gray fur, ringed tail, and black bandit mask. The raccoon is a skilled climber, able to ascend trees with ease, where it can search for food or hide away during the daylight hours. They'll take advantage of hollow cavities in trees, beneath stumps, or even within old buildings. The raccoon is also known for its inclination to search for food near bodies of water. Upon finding a potential meal, this mammal will plunge it into the water as if washing it for consumption. But what is it really doing? The secret lies in the raccoon's special hands, loaded with nerve bundles that allow them to feel for what tastes good and what doesn't. The action of dunking food heightens this sensitivity, allowing the animal to detect the good parts of food such as insects, fish, frogs, worms, acorns, nuts, berries, eggs, and even baby birds from nests. But the secret to the raccoon's varied diet is in its teeth. With sharp front teeth for meat and flat back molars for plants, the raccoon is well equipped to eat an omnivorous diet. But this diet has made them go from a cute woodland resident to an abhorrent urban pest. Enjoying many of the same foods as humans, it's quite common for campers and homeowners alike to discover that raccoons have pilfered garbage or recycling, looking for meals. Indeed, even an unlocked vehicle containing food is no match for the dexterity of the raccoon, let alone a cooler or a jar of peanut butter. The Algonquian people first named this animal, calling it Arakun, meaning he who scratches with his hands. But, despite their poor reputation, raccoons remain one of the most abundant, interesting, and downright adorable mammals found at Sandbanks Provincial Park. This has been My Nature. Join us next time.